right. Now, lyrically, my game is nice. I can steal a rhyme without your mind and sell it back to you for half price. I might even do it twice. You see, I spit precise, powerfully potent paragraphs that penetrate the pituitary gland and make your mind expand. Make you understand this is a very so hot between slinging and rock and trading and stock. See, this is basic economics. Buy low, sell high. Your price determines what demand meets supply. See, most of us don't want to admit it or even hear it. But see, being a drug dealer is the epitome of the entrepreneurial spirit. See, capitalism breeds capitalists. So if this demand for a product, best believe somebody's going to supply it. See, they got the right mind, just the wrong grind. Because see, really, even Eli Liddy sells drugs of all kinds. We don't have to worry about packing knives who's tapping their phone line because they got politicians and public opinion on their side. See, the only way to survive in this society is to have a hustle mentality. See, as long as you're working for your money and your money's not working for you, you'll forever be a slave. Bill Gates did not stack all that cake just sitting around waiting for a promotion to raise it. Now you got the whole game on lock and he ain't worried about prison time. So if you can flip a sixteenth into an ounce and an ounce into a kid, it seems to be no reason to me you can't exert the same amount of energy and learning to hustle the down Jones industrial. So you need to be fucking with that NASDAQ, leave that crack alone. Or you could just invest in a duplex home and rent it to two different tenants and use the rent money to pay off the loan at half the time. <laughs> Or you can continue to grind and hustle them drugs in the streets. But Pete, ain't about what you got. It's about what you can keep. You see, when that task force sweep, best believe they're taking the cars, the rims, the beats, the cast, the crib, and the platinum Jesus piece. End up getting sentenced to a 10-piece and get released and try to look for peace. But you can't get to a piece because that felony on your record got you marked as a beast. You got to go back to the streets so you can cop you a piece so you can take you a piece. That's why the streets don't see peace. That just went in many vicious cycles to compromise the struggle. Now, understand we can't all do it like Dr. Heathcliff Huxtable, so don't stop hustling, just change your hustle. See, America is designed for to get rich. There's a man who went ways for to get paid off in this bitch, and most of them is legit. Just find a market you want to target, produce a service and do a product, and your revenues minus your expenses is going to equal your profit. See, see it's just basic economics. As long as you have the haves, you always have the have-nots. So it's up to you to decide whether or not you're happy with what you got. And if not, you got to concoct a plot that's going to raise the stock and be willing to hustle and grind from sunrise to sun drop. Because believe me, ejaculation is the only thing that comes easy. And too many cats have played a lot of think the stock market is too risky. And now I know I spit this poem with a whole lot of ebonics, but it don't matter who said it or how it's been said. It's still just basic economics. <laughs> New York.